Thank you for inviting me to participate in this celebration. The Real Life Bell empowers people to make decisions that are deeply personal, central, as how they will live their lives. The Real Life Bell allows people with developmental, developmental and intellectual disabilities choose where they live, who they live with. I also let them have a choice in the pe people that they want in their lives and what type of relationship they want to have with them. The bill helps people to become a valued and contributing member of their communities. Right now, many of those personal decisions that most people have taken for granted are determined by others. With our input, the Realized Bill will allow us to actively participate in the self-determination and having the control in our lives. And it does this in a reasonable manner in giving individuals the support they need to make difficult decisions. <laughs> the Real Life Bill supports self-determination and available for all individuals who receive services through the Department of Developmental Services and it utilizes person-centered funding model and the services are received. The funding model, the innovative cost neutral that Massachusetts and the federal government already are moving towards. The passage of the Realized Bill represents the fundamental shift in how people with disabilities are perceived. It also expresses confidence in individuals with developmental and intellectual disabilities as self-advocates whose own desires and interests should be the central to our plans in our lives. I want to thank Tom Sidney Kendro and staff, Math Advocate Standing Strong, the Mastown Syndrome Congress, the Art and many other agencies, and hundreds of others across the state who helped to make this happen. And thank you, Governor Patrick, for signing the Real Life Bill.